Uh, I think it's a really good spot, probably the best I've sailed in Europe. Uh, and um, we had a really good week. I've been here for a few days now. We scored all types of conditions, so I guess this contest could be anything. Uh, I don't know, I'm just basically going to try to get everything organized and, and everything ready on the beach because I believe in a place like here you can have awesome conditions but you can easily go from a 5-0 to a 3-7 in the same heat. So I'm just going to try to be as prepared as I can with all my gear set up in the beach and uh, depending on the day I'm going to try to sail the best I can and be positive and hopefully do well. Last year we had a few cold days, but it wasn't too bad, and this year is warm. It hasn't been cold at all. I have been on a 3-2 millimeter wetsuit all the days I sailed, and uh, it hasn't been that cold at all. So it's been actually really fun conditions, and uh, not too bad. It was good. We had a few really strong wind days, dead on shore, and then straight after we had side shore. And then we also had uh, like really strong 3-4 weather day, and we had everything during this past week. So. It's hard to expect what's going to come for the event, but uh, I guess whatever it comes, we are, we are going to have fun. I think by the looking at the forecast, we could imagine we will see some really big jumps. Uh, it looks like the wind will be like really proper strong and, and the wind is also going to be kind of side shore. So that means you're going to, sailors are going to hit the ramps really straight. And uh, that's normally the condition that is easiest to jump the highest. And uh, I expect some really fun jumping action. From everyone. Uh, it really depends on the conditions. If it's more kind of sideshow, I believe all of us are going to focus more on the wave riding. If it gets really strong winds, uh, I think last year we saw push loop forwards, double forwards, and I think that's what most of the riders are going to go for in case it gets really like 4 2, 4 5, and down. And uh, if it gets dead on shore and light, we're going to see probably some tricks on the wave. People are going to just try to do whatever jumps they can to get it into the, to the scoring. It really depends on the conditions, but from what it looks like, I think we could see some massive push forwards and doubles from everyone.